Hi Cancer, it's Elle here to do your mid-July uh, 2018 general reading. It's a general read. It won't resonate with everyone, but if it does resonate with you, please like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It's much appreciated. I will save the announcements to the end. All right. So, um, it looks like some of you are waiting for some clarity around like a money situation maybe in a, a judgment or some legal issue waiting for some truth like final decision around that that's an obstacle here to you know you having a bit of financial stability um whew. love is scattered it's complicated for you so there's someone that you really love, someone that you'll probably spend the rest of your life with, someone you'll marry, but that's kind of far off because you guys, there's distance between the two of you. Either it's physical distance, I see water, um, or there's like emotional, mental distance. Like you guys are not seeing eye to eye. You haven't been in contact with this person. For one of the, because you, some of you might be already partnered with somebody and it's in regards to money. Like you're staying with somebody for money or you, or there's a lot of heavy obligation that you feel towards the other person. Um, so you stay there to provide for them monetarily or vice versa. They feel this way about you. Um, they're like scatters of friends. Um there's a reliable friend who's looking at the whole situation they may have even given you advice about what you should do or how you should move but you're just kind of letting things happen as they will almost like the hangman card just like in suspended animation it's almost as if there's a knowing here like you know something is going to happen you know that you're going to change there's gonna be some great change of partnership in, in love you know that there the judgment is coming in regards to money um you got some really good things happening for you in your career to offers possibly uh okay so so some truth and clarity just stands alone here so it's like you're not speaking exactly how you feel about situations to certain people there's not a lot of groundedness you could be dealing with the earth sign capricorn virgo taurus they're out of whack you're a little out of whack there's not groundedness because nobody's talking nobody's speaking their truth um you get you have a reli you have a reliable friend here male or female who will give you advice but you i mean you listen but okay so that's that. Let's get into the cards. Okay, let's start with love. All right, thank you, Heavenly Father, for the messages for Cancer in Love. Four cards. What is Cancer going through in love? Thank you for the messages. Thank you for the love messages for Cancer. bottom of the deck we'll look at that uh, career and finance what are the messages for cancer for career and finance career and finance for Okay. 
All right, the bottom of the deck, wow. The will of fortune in love. Like I said in the stones, a lot of you are just letting things happen naturally as they should. Um, the wheel is always turning. It's turning for all of us all the time. Uh, looks like it may be turning in your favor, especially with you loosening the reins and just letting things happen. Um, remember what goes around comes around. What you put out comes back to you. Hopefully you've been putting out good, whatever you deem is good. So that'll come back to you. Okay. So destined events too. Like destiny is here. Like you can't get away from it. You may have tried to shake it in the past, but it's here. Okay. So we have the eight of pentacles, the seven of swords, the five of cups, queen of swords. Um, looks like, like I said, some of you, um, okay some of you feel like you chose the wrong path the wrong partner you may just be putting time and energy into yourself some of you may be going back to school some of you may be spending additional time at work because home life is um it's not good or it's not what you want it to be some of you are at the seven of swords or someone around you is like that can't uh gemini libra aquarius where they're devising a plan of action possibly to sneak away to do something or they're being sneaky or this is you you've been sneaky at work or something in regards to work or money um but you're also missing someone it's like like i said it's like you you possibly you were in a third party situation somebody walked away or something ended and all you can think about is this but you have this and I saw those two stones off um, you know in a distance um, you can have that two of cups relationship once you come out of this recognize that this did not serve you it didn't serve you it didn't serve the other person it didn't serve the person you're with you have to make a decision don't just grieve the third party situation being over or you know them being gone but understand that you have to transform the energy into what you want it to be um queen of swords i think some of you feel like this is your partner they're cutting you out or they cut you out or you need to cut them out you could be dealing with a gemini libra aquarius typically this is gemini um yeah you feel like they cut you out and that's why you're sad. This is your energy, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. The person you're with could be cutting you out. Um, the person that you were that was outside of the relationship could have cut you out. It's just a complete shakeup here for you. You thought it would never end, or not never end, but you just you didn't think they would leave like that. But um, I think, and this could be your energy, Cancer, whatever you want. Or whomever you want they want more from you or vice versa you want more from the other person and they're not providing it for you uh, if you're dealing with the Gemini Libra Aquarius they could possibly be sneaking around it could have something to do with work someone at work uh, or this could be you you could be sneaking around at work somebody's working on themselves working on being single the next card would be nine of pentacles i think for some of my cancers you're doing that also bottom of the deck for career and finance the devil card temptation um you feel stuck you feel trapped you feel tied to it's a oxymoron it's a catch-22 i leave this position what kind of life do i have i stay i'm still miserable judgment call judgment two of earth yeah the moon the page of earth yeah it's exactly what i just said it's like you have an offer somewhere else you can be doing something else you want to be doing something else you're weighing up these two very real offers or these two very real options um they're here you know you they're here for the taking they're real which one will you um, engage in? This is also about a business deal, too. It might not be favorable. This is where you have to make a complete judgment call on this business deal or these two offers. You have to choose and be definite in it. Um, it looks like Spirit's going to work with you and give you some insight as to what 
uh, you should be doing write your dreams down uh, your intuition will be heightened here they'll speak th to you through dreams and um, signs heavenly little signs maybe things people say songs items you know anything can be of significant right of, of significance right now um, to help you gain clarity on what you should do in this um, career and finance sector because there is a met there someone's telling you like hey you could do this over here and we have room for you over here and maybe you should invest in this or maybe you know so there's like messages of stability of stability elsewhere okay right bottom of the deck uh, butterfly oracle cards motivation yeah so motivation comes firstly from you it's not external from you um, if you're expecting someone else to motivate you to be great then that's kind of asinine to be honest um, motivation comes exactly inherently from you first um, how bad do you want it how hungry are you, are you? how um, how hard will you work for it? Most cancers are hard workers, especially the men. Um, but most, anyhow. Um, so, have the motivation. Also, sometimes it talks about depression. Um, you may be, feel like you're in a depressed state with this devil card. Um, you have to start. It starts with knowing that there's better. Knowing that there are options. Um speaking your truth to I saw truth off to the side and the stones some of you aren't really talking about how you feel Re uh, religion and spirituality yeah that's here for you um, I think like I said some of you have a knowing a knowing that this is going to be this way or knowing that you know um, you need to change careers or something of that nature spirituality and religion are highlighted here changing your mind definitely like I said in the first spread some of you feel like you chose the wrong path you chose the wrong partner um, health care change okay um, this talks about getting a second opinion um, getting a second third fourth opinion talks about actually getting proactive about your health um, because uh, though we you know though you visit the physician and they have the schooling they have the certificates they have the the degrees and the experience um, you still know your body because it's your body so if you feel like um, maybe a diagnosis is off or you just not it's not sitting well with you or maybe someone around you get a second opinion um, also be concerned about your health and what's going on with you especially with you working a lot here with the eight of pentacles um, some of you may even be drinking very sad health care change some of you could be depressed you have to speak about it all right so I hope that this reading resonated for you with you um, request a personal reading to get your energy I take advantage of the two question uh, $20 reading go over to my website book it there or send me an email or follow me on Insta go and ask a question or two there uh, choose to fund the page by clicking the GoFundMe link keep in mind that commenting below automatically enters you to for the raffle to win a free reading so go ahead and comment below even if you're saying hi okay um, thank you for tuning in once again know that I'm praying for you pray for me as well take care guys until August